Our look at the best submissions of the Strike Force season continues with Eric Lawson, a submission specialist who battled it out with middleweight Tony Johnson in November of 08. Johnson was the younger and taller of the two fighters, and he came in with an undefeated record. Lawson had four submissions already under his belt. The fight was scheduled for three five-minute rounds, but as you're about to see, it didn't take nearly that long for the finish. Here's how it unfolded. Lawson on the left in the white trunks. Tony Johnson in the black trunks. Now, once these guys touch, man, you're going to... They both have this uh, mindset that they're going to get the fight done in the first round, so it should be interesting. <laughs> Always makes it a fun fight. And these guys will use all their energy they can early on, so the fans are going to love it. You know, a lot of guys get warmed up by having to get out there and get going fast. Lawson taking some swings. Johnson tried to take down. He was thwarted. Yeah, you know, he's... Lawson's got to get inside because he definitely has a disadvantage. He's the shorter of the two. And uh, in order for him to be effective, he's going to have to get inside at close distance. If he stays outside like that, he's going to get picked apart. Lawson grabs the leg of Johnson, but he cannot take him down. Good defense by Johnson. Yeah, and that's exactly what Lawson has to do. He's got to get in like this. He's got to be able to get up underneath him and be able to sweep him and get him to the ground. Two strong fighters, neither one allowing the takedown. Mm, that was a big haymaker right there. He threw that thing from left field, man. Oh, wow. and then Lawson with a great roundhouse punch, and he continues to pepper away at Johnson. Wow, he caught him on the chin, and he went down, and he is in a bad position right now. Oh, he's right got now. the choke now. He's got Johnson. a strong choke right there. See how he locks his hands together? That's a tough choke right there. And that's it. You see Johnson tap out. And Lawson comes true on his prediction, a first-round victory. Uh, he came true on his word, all right, man. That was explosive. As soon as he hit him with that right hand, he jumped his back, got him into that strong choke, and, man, he did not let up from there, man. He put a, put a powerful choke on him. And I tell you, man, when you're in that situation, you're hoping the bell will ring. Look at the bells. He hit him right there on the chin and rang his bell. Once he, once he landed that punch, you see he kept his position, pushing his head down, and landed punches, and he positioned himself so he catches back when he came up. He locked his wrists together, pulled guard on him, and when he had him in that position, man, that's a real strong. There's that right hand again, and he, he lays out on him, pushes his head down, and continues to land those strikes. He never loses position as he's trying to escape here. Boss gets behind him, locks his hands together, puts his legs in, and he applies that choke, man. That's a strong choke. Tony Johnson, the striker, done in by the submission specialist, Eric Lawson. At one minute and 28 seconds of round one, the winner by tap out with a rear naked choke, Eric Lawless Lawson. Lawson now eight and two after his submission victory over Tony Johnson.